Thanks a lot for coming, Josh. I appreciate you, man. I'll give you the uh, the COVID pound. That's right. Yeah, yeah. So, dude, uh, you are a wealth of knowledge in the financial space, and I really wanted to provide value back to the people that watch this show. So, tell me a little bit about who you are, what you do, and how you go about your business. Yeah. So, again, my name is Josh Payne, and, and uh, you know, I've been in the financial industry now for 13 years, and uh, I was born and raised here in Sacramento have roots deep here yes. uh, uh, in the city. And um, ultimately what led me to this industry was just the, the drive to provide financial literacy to people that are typically uh, left out of, of the, the opportunity to learn. Just like my wife and I were when we first sat down and, and, and learned about it for ourselves. And right. it just ignited that passion to make sure that everyone else wasn't left out of, of the information to prepare for the future. Right, so so tell me a little bit, I know you have a, a phenomenal philosophy. We, we talked about this a little bit off camera. Tell me about your philosophy on finances and, and how you help other people with this space. Yeah, so essentially is this, right? I try and make things very fundamental, right? <laughs> and, the, yeah, the basic person, makes sense. Man. That's right, and so here's the reality of life, right? One of two things is gonna happen to, to everybody in life. We're either gonna die too soon <laughs> or we're gonna live too long. Simple. And so the question is, do we have a plan in place to take care of both? Right. So, all right, so dive a little bit deeper and, and I wanna see if you can provide some value. And I hope that you guys reach out to, to Josh because I'm definitely gonna set up a meeting with you with me and my wife. Um, if someone is too, for say, hopefully not die, not die, you don't want them to die too soon, but what's that action plan that you would help with in order to, to help with that? Absolutely, so the reality of dying too soon, it's the foundation to preparing a plan for the future, right? right. And uh, because tomorrow's never promised. And the reality is, if we're looking at dying too soon, it's about making sure the family has the right life insurance in place. But better yet, it's the concept of income protection because what happens when one of the breadwinners in a family is to pass away too soon, there's two deaths. There's the death of the loved one, which we can't do anything about. Right. And there's the death of the income. Now we can't protect or we can't do anything about the personal That's a catastrophe. Good point. I don't think people think of that. No. That's a great point. But what we do is we secure the fact that there won't be a financial catastrophe along with it. I love that. So, all right, so let's flip the script a little bit. And and we always, it, it, the money always sometimes runs out and people don't have the plan for if somebody lives too long, how do you guys prepare for that? Or how yeah. would you personally prepare for that? Yeah, great you... question. And and this is really the fun part, right? Yeah. 95% um, of the population is gonna live too long, right? 5% that pass away early, they've gotta be protected because that's the foundation. But But what does living too long mean? That typically gets a chuckle out of most people. And the reality right. of life is this, we've got to make sure we've got money put aside for retirement yeah. to make those golden years golden. The largest growing population in our country is 90 and above. And so people are living longer, medical advances. And so if we wanna have dignity in the retirement years, we've got to have a serious investment plan in place to be able to accumulate enough money to have freedom that everybody desires for those retirement years. That's that's great knowledge because there's so many people that don't plan for that what if, if it goes even longer, you live in your 90s or you're 100, what do you do then, right? right. And then what is the family that, that could potentially put a burden on a family right. member or whatever. So if somebody would like to take some action, right? Actually take some action financially and protect themselves. How could they get a hold of you? Maybe give your email, phone number, or um, a social media handle where they can, can learn a little bit more about you. Absolutely. So again, you can reach me. My cell phone number is 408-220-4590. That's my direct cell phone. Uh, my email is josh at josh B pain p a y n e dot com so josh at josh dot com or you can find me on instagram at at josh b pain and uh, i'd love to connect with anybody if just not to provide value to you in your planning needs